Hey, what's going on, guys? It's Seth Dragon here, back to you guys with another YouTube video. And uh, in today's video, guys, we're like building a base tube out of an old 10 inch sub and you know, a bucket that we found out in the carport. So, like, yeah, so here's how we're gonna do it. Alright, so the plan was we got the bucket, right? And we cut out some wood into the circle. I know, look. My mom's boyfriend did it. It's like a crappy circle. But uh but the subwoofer well first we're gonna pack insulation inside of that. Then the subwoofer will sit on top like this. And everything's gonna be sealed up. The it's got liquid nail all over the sides of it covered so it'll be you know sound proof down into there. And all the screws on the sides, we put some liquid nail on there too. And there's a little hole down here at the bottom so the wires can run through the bottom out and come out and hook it up in my truck out there. Or we're first probably going to test it inside because there's like entertainment system in there with all that crap and it'll pretty, sound pretty good. So I think that's what we're going to do. But this liquid nail had to dry for 24 hours so this afternoon I'm going to be sanding the whole bucket down and uh, spraying it black so it'll be glossy black finish and I think it's gonna look pretty good and the subwoofer sits in here and it gets screwed in to here like through here see screw it down in so it'll be secure and I've been wanting to do this for a while and I finally you know figured hey why not I got this sub sitting around so why don't I just make something out of it so that's what I did so the plan is if it's loud enough it's gonna go back there in the very back, but instead of running it through this to the back speaker on the other side like I did for this subwoofer, I'm gonna I have like these wire splicer things that like cut into the wire and it connects it, and I'm probably just gonna run it through there and connect it all up together so I don't have to take the covers off of that bull crap. These are the wire connectors that I have. They're uh, See how they work is you put one wire into one side and then you flip the little plastic piece over and it puts the little metal bar, a little metal thing into the wires and it connects them. But it's got those little holes in it if you get it to focus. In order to get it to focus I had to take it out of the package but it's got those two little metal things with the holes in it so it'll slice through there when you push this down. Here I'll just push this one through so you guys can see it. You take it and you have it like this, and you press it down like that, and it clips together at the bottom, and then now on the inside, the two wires are connected. So that's basically how it works. I'll have to use two of these connectors to, um, for the positive and the negative wires. After waiting for the paint to dry, I can finally put it together. So I put all the insulation inside there. I'm gonna put this in and then pull the wires tight and then screw this thing down in there because I'm I'm ready to hear it. I'm ready to see if it's gonna sound good, if it's gonna sound crappy, or what, because I have no idea what it's gonna sound like. So let's see. Alright, we're testing it inside right now, so. Let's see. 
Turn it up. truck and see what it sounds like guys so here's the final result got the sub in here in the very back also got this other sub see like you may think yo what are you broke or something you can't get like an authentic car audio system or crap like that no it's just if you can make it yourself for cheap like this was free besides buying the spray paint if you can do all that crap Without having to pay all that and still get the same good quality of audio, why would you even buy that other crap? Just for looks? No, I don't really care about looks. I kind of do, but this is just for now. In the future, I'll be upgrading to, you know, car audio stuff. Like, not this, like, entertainment system crap and this bucket base thing. But, uh, yeah. That's going to be the end of this video, guys. I hope you did enjoy. Me and my little brother are about to take truck for a ride through the neighborhood we we're about to play the thomas the train theme song bass boosted i'll be sure to record that in case people are outside but uh yeah thanks for watching uh the video i hope you liked it if you did please leave a giant thumbs up comment your opinion down below and share it with your friends and if you guys want to help me out help this channel grow to where i can make awesome videos Click the link in the description, go to my Patreon account, and uh, yeah, just become a Patreon and help the channel out so we can grow and do awesome videos. But check out the next video. The next video is going to be the installing the cold air intake on my truck. So uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, peace. Go.